Alright guys, let's get cracking. Let's uh, continue playing Otherworld, number one, Spring of Shadows, you know, before the third game is up. Uh, it's a pink dragon. See? See? It's a dragonfly dragon. Oh look, he's back in the bonus game. Whoa. I'm pissed though that he died, that the Hobgoblin died, apparently. I'm seriously pissed. I really hope that they, the statues will all come to life. I'm really pissed with that. <sighs> Alright, so quick melody to summon the Kelpie. Oh. Okay, we're gonna do it like this, are we? This one was totally not correct. Almost. I can't remember any more <laughs> of them. Yes! Woohoo! New achievement, a clear mind. Completed 40 mini games without using hints. It would be so cool if I didn't use hints, any hints in this whole game, but okay. Yeah. yeah, get over here, you idiot. Hate you. Give the hobgoblin back. I should feed it kelp weed now. Oh. <sighs> I see we needed a knife to get the kelp weed. Oh my god. We are running back again. Taking our weekend trips to Vegas as it loads. Not that I've even been there. I haven't even been in, in the North American continent, so... You know. Right, now we have to go all the way back. Wait, do you use the map to jump there directly? Uh-huh. In your face, game. I've come for your hobgoblin friend, he is mine. If you come for your hobgoblin friend, he's mine. Yeah, I know, we didn't have that voice before. Alive for life. If you come for the girl in the photograph, then I must warn you that your plan will most likely fail. I don't really care, stupid. Before Fiona was taken, she handed me this golden charm and asked me to protect it until the locket bearer comes. Take it, and then I'm gonna tell you what you need to know. You still look dead, dude. Give me my hub goblin back. You suck. Now listen and take heed, for I will not repeat this tale. You have shame and fearless one, subdue this water spirit. You are not the first mortal to rescue Fiona. There was another one, a woman. Fiona spoke of her dearly. Oh? I like his voice though. No mortal can withstand the Shade's attack, but he did not kill her. He did something much worse. Go to town and find her, if you do not believe me. Maybe you can succeed where she did not. Chapter 4, The Curio Shop. Alright. <gasps> Fairy! I still hate the Kelpie for taking the Hobgoblin. That sucks so much, I'm gonna never ever get over it. But I do like love his accent. The flap is sealed tight. How I seen this moon shape before? Uh, no, you haven't. But oh, uh, sure. Commemorative tower showing the town's history. I can barely see an illustration here. Where's the rest of the poster? I don't know. What 
Whoever owns this store knew Fiona's family. There's something stuck inside this small hole. Main Street. Hello, Main Street. Very. Oh, is the community billboard anything interesting? Nah. Too much stuff on top of each other. There's no way to see if there actually is anything interesting here or not. Oh! Oh, I was done. Might be useful. Poster piece. None of these stores look like a curio shop. How do I find it? You don't. It's hard to leave through them while clipped. Great, the sheets of paper are all soaked. Yes, they are. Oh, I need it non-wet? Well, let's just hang it up here. And it's dry. That was cool, I guess. Take poster. It's an old shop on Main Street. I should go there to compare. Find 12 differences between old and new Main Street. I'm just clicking stuff, actually. Whoa! Ho! 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 Okay! Penalties for clicking too much! We get the shade all up in our face! Thank you for that, dude. Not... Oh, there was the last thing. Okay. No skipping. There was an old woman in the photo outside that gate. Why are we back here then? I can open the gate with this bike padlocked to it. Oh my god. Why would you padlock your bike to a gate that I need? Oh, uh, we're pretty stuck in town. <laughs> Thank you. Most legit use of pen ever. Yeah. Go away, bike. I think I can pick them loose with your pen. Yeah, we can! Pick with pen. That is cool. Uh, click on a pin in the correct on a pins in the correct order. Sequence open the lock. If the sequence is correct, the pins will stay up. Otherwise, there's brute force. It's totally brute force. Isn't that lovely? Sorry, I already tried that combination. Yes, thank you. I was like, please, please. Mmm, back alley. Now, if only I could extend my reach and hook that fire escape. Need a boat hook. Fairy.
We just need water in our pitcher all the time. Can I please see the store window? That's gonna be clean for ages. It's a rag. Oh, hello. Hey, what are you doing back here? Hey, what are you doing? You're not supposed to be back here. And why are you poking around that abandoned building for? Speak up. Oh, so you're the woman who bought the house out in the country. Well, I suppose you have some questions. Come inside then. I just opened the general store. Okay. A strange symbol adorns and maybe opens the shop. It's like a crest, but I don't understand it. The cat slipped through here. Nothing round has made an impression on the mat. Okay. No. Can we fill the picture again? Yes, we can. Uh, where's the general store then? Oh, here. It's a shame what happened to Fiona and her family. We all liked them, even if they were a bit eccentric to some. Fiona visited the shop a lot. Her mom kept a bunch of Fiona's things here just in case she needed babysitting. They're in the footlocker over there if you want to take a look. Alright. I will take those can openers and ice. Thank you very much. There's a fairy. Galoshes. Really? That word exists in English? Cool. I thought that was the sweetest thing. To which item is the store owner referring? She- Oh yes, it's the story thingies! She bought two of these stuffed toys, I think she kept the other one at her house. Um... <gasps> Bo. Now I want a teddy bear. Where's the teddy bear? There we go. Fiona kept going on adventures and messing up her hair. Her mom kept this here just in case. Brush. She always said a storm was coming, so she brought this everywhere. Umbrella. She li loved old folk tales, even the scary ones. This water horse didn't scare at all. Kelpie. Fiona liked fairy tales. She left this behind once, pending to be Cinderella. Fiona liked to explore the countryside on her own. She brought this to find her way home again. A map? Compass. She would look up at the stars with this as if she knew something we didn't. She probably did. Ah. Uh... Stop, 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 stop. I, I even knew it was going to come, but it still scared me. <laughs> oh, there. There, I, I get it. Telescope. She carried this around constantly, but never filled it with food. Babe seeing Fiona was easy. She just needed this and would draw all day. It's my beautiful umbrella. It's a toy display and I need a fish to open it. Wait, do you want to have something else to say now? Go. Well, back to work now. Feel free to take a look around the shop. Alright. Wait, I have no idea what to do. Oh! That was actually a good hint. Here we go. Hello, fairy. Rookie collector, find 30 collectibles. Yay. Oh, I see, I see. I understand. Hey, kitty, kitty, kitty. Thank you. Oh yeah, very, very black. What? Let's open the mailbox. Hello, stuff. 
I've got just a thing to open this with. Yes, ancient knife. Letter from Fiona's parents. Mathilde? Math I don't even know how you would say that in English. Mathilde. Uh, he's after us. We return your lens that lo unlocks the secret of the crest. Thank you. Fiona's parents knew the shade was after their daughter. Oh no. I've got stuff. I just don't know what to do with it. Um. All right. Lens reveals a hidden message. It does. Where? Oh, here. Okay. Took on different parts of the crest to change them. Use the lens to reveal hidden clues. Oh. Okay, I think this is right. Uh, this is right, right? One of those. We want one sun. One of those. Oh, one of the leaves and one of the flowers, I guess? I don't know. Oh wait, we want the flower there. There we go! Lens reveal hidden message. It's the curio shop. Shop. Ooh, we got all the galoshes now. And more kitty cats. No matter how much I knock, no one answers. Shop owner sure does love cats. I would like that fish though. Fairy. Where's the bell to pull? It's here. It's weird. Ringing the bell produces no sound. Is it broken? Ring bell for service. It's a little difficult when it's broken. Oh. Okay. I don't know. Um... So, so stuck. Okay. Oh. Um... I can't get to it. Okay, yeah, that helped me much. I don't know what that did, and rather made things worse. Ah. Uh, uh, eh. What? I do not understand. Okay, can I pry that fish out of the cat's mouth with my knife or something, please? I really like that. Fish. I actually think- oh no, no, you need an eye. Oops. Well... I got it. I got it. I know you all got it before me, but I got it in the end. Here we go. I want that. Thank you very much. We are getting a screwdriver. Na 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 na. Why do we need it? I have no idea. Oh, to fix the bell? 
No. Come on. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to. Oh, there. Okay, okay. There, I see. Apparently, I don't see. Um. Hello? Okay, where am I supposed to click? Okay, on the bell? Where is the right hitbox? <sighs> right. Right. Um Okay, well we'll we'll break here and um I'll I'll figure it out. Either we'll spend the next episode trying to figure that part out or you know I'll I'll figure it out off camera. But I don't know. But anyhow. Uh thank you all for watching and I'll see you again very soon.